Hey guys, uh, welcome to your general uh, energy check-in uh, for the zodiac sign of Leo. This is going to be the Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs for December 2021. We're going to take a look at your over energies, what's surrounding you guys, what you guys need to know, what you guys could expect for December. Uh, and then we will see what the possible outcome and advice are. Keep in mind that this could be in anything. Uh, love, uh, romance, relationships, friendships, family, career, finances, uh, personal development, spiritual development. We will see what the cards pick up. Uh, before we get started, if you guys haven't done so yet, hit, hit the subscription button and the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post. Give this video a thumbs up like this video so that this message can circulate around to the individuals that need to hear this. Share this video with someone if you feel like there's someone out there that you know that needs to hear this. And leave a comment down in the comment section below if this message resonates. Uh, for those of you guys that are interested in booking a private personal reading with me, the link is in the description box below. All right, Leo, let's get started. Um, Overall energies for Leo. What is surrounding Leo? What does Leo need to know? What can Leo expect for December 2021? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs, and also Jupiter. Um, let's see what I have here. and the Five of Swords. Okay. Scorpio energy could be dealing with, with could be dealing with the Scorpio. You might have Scorpio in your chart. You have the Knight of Swords in the world. So someone is changing their mind about something here. So it could be a situation where someone left and now they're deciding to come back. Uh, keep in mind this could be you. Um, feel free to apply this to your own unique situation. Feel free to switch the roles if you want, okay? Also keep in mind that this is just a general reading. I'm tapping into the collective Leo. I'm not tapping into one specific person's energy. So just take what resonates and leave the rest behind. All right, we have the Three of Swords in the Hermit here. Three of Pentacles. I don't know, I feel like someone here is playing a game. I feel like someone here left expecting someone to chase them. And then when someone didn't chase, this person maybe was like, oh shit, I changed my mind. I don't want to play like this anymore. Because whatever someone did here, I mean, someone here is like hurt by this. You might be hurt, they might be hurt, both of these might be hurt. Let's see what else we have here. Could be dealing with the Virgo here. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Scorpio. You might have those energies in your chart, Leo. Why is death here? Tell me about death. Four of Cups. Feels like someone here should have, it feels like someone here did something that they shouldn't have done, I feel. And I feel like this was maybe a bit of a game. Like, like I said, Five of Swords, King of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. So you might be dealing with a Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo. You might have those energies in your chart, Knight of Swords, and the Five of Cups. Yeah, uh, so I feel like someone here regrets playing games here. Like I said, it, it's an energy where I feel like someone ran off thinking that you would chase them. And when you didn't chase, they were like, oh no. Yeah, the world. The sun, Leo energy, could be dealing with another Leo here. I mean, I feel like this person sees you, sees you as their happiness. This person is trying to undo the damage that they've caused here. Three of Swords. 
Oh, wow. You withdrew from this, uh, Leo. So um, you could apply this to your own unique situation. I don't know. Maybe you're this King of Pentacles that was playing a games, or you're this Empress that was hurt by this. Um, so Libra, Taurus, Energy, Hermit, Four of Wands. So we have an Empress that does not want this. So this Empress is someone here that's really withdrawing from this whole situation from this person and just wanting time to themselves right now. Yeah, we have someone here that doesn't want this. Someone here is confused. I mean, you're confused. That king is confused. Why they walked away, why they ghosted you. They thought that you were going to put in some sort of effort to chase them or something like that. I don't know. Seems like this person was testing you. Seems like this person might have been testing you, uh, Leo. All right. Let's see. Action and advice here for Leo regarding their situation. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. All right. I added a Jupiter because if anything about, you know, your fortune or your work comes up, this could apply the dot, but it doesn't seem like it is. Alcon and advice for uh, Leo regarding their situation for the month of December, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. High Priestess and the Seven of Wands. Cancer energy, Pisces energy. Could be dealing with a Cancer or a Pisces. You might have those energies in your chart. You have the Eight of Swords and the Page of Swords here. Uh, I feel like we have someone here that's freaking out a bit because I feel like someone here is, you know, trying to look you up on social media, trying to get information on you, trying to send you a text message, trying to send you an email, but you're like not replying. This person's losing their mind a bit, I feel. Seven of Pentacles and the Hermit again. This is a twin flame connection. Could be a strong soul tie that you have with this person. We have this Empress here that's really taking some time out to look back at their, their own mistakes here. Uh, 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 perhaps their own mistakes in allowing someone to play these um, childish games. You might ghost on them, and this person's freaking out now. Well, they they want to ghost on you first, and you're like, okay, if you want to ghost me, that's fine because I'm gonna ghost you. Uh, and you just you just you just went into hermit mode, Leo. Uh, tell me about this high priestess here. High priestess in the wheel of fortune. Someone here is facing their karma. They go to say you, now you're ghosting them. And pro they probably didn't even expect it. Uh, seven of Wands and the Seven of Wands. I feel like this person is trying to defend their behavior too. Eight of Swords, Three of Wands. Now we have someone here that's waiting for you to come back. But Leo, I feel like you're not coming back. Page of Swords, Nine of Swords. You're just tired of the BS, you're tired of the games. Uh, this person could be, you know, could be uh, traumatized by this whole situation. Could be dealing with someone here who has abandonment issues. It's like maybe this person had these narrative in their mind that, you know, oh, you know, Leo's going to leave me, so I'm going to leave before um, Leo leaves me. Uh, Seven of Pentacles. Ace of Pentacles. Um, so the Empress is off exploring new beginnings elsewhere. Yeah, this person is no longer putting in any sort of effort into this connection with this king. Um, Hermit. Knight of Pentacles. We have someone here that keeps approaching this Empress, and this Empress is completely ghosted. Completely ghosted them. Ghosted this king.
Yeah, it just seemed like someone here was testing someone, and... And, uh, someone here messed up, so... So, Leo, hope this was helpful. Hope this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Share this video, like this video. If you haven't done so yet, subscribe. Hit the, notifi hit the notification bell, and I will speak to you guys in the next one. All right, thanks, guys.